Hi everybody, it's Ryan from Ryan G's Barbecue and Stuff. Today I'm in the hashtag drink tips. The people joining me in this collaboration are Chef Adventures, Just88, Jamie Mack and The Silly Kitchen. So stay around, I'm going to show you the cocktail that I'm going to make. It's called the Blue Devil or some people call it the Blue Arrow. The only difference is between the two, one uses lime juice with no garnish. So I'm going to make a blue arrow because I haven't got any lemon juice and I don't have a garnish so I'm going to show the procedure let's get to doing it the blue devil or the blue arrow is quite a punchy little cocktail it consists of three parts gin one part curacao blue one part lemon juice or lime juice I'm going to use lime juice because I don't actually have any lemon juice and I've got to use the stuff you put on pancakes because we're in lockdown again and one part maraschino which is that the cherry um, for the blue devil you use a lemon to actually garnish it again I don't have any lemon so that's why I'm making the blue arrow I'm going to show you how to do that now and I'm just gonna start to bosh the ingredients in so we put that to one side we get the jigger there's actually three parts of this so I'll do one big one Go in that, and then we'll be using the little one from now on. So that's three parts gin. I'm using Bombay Sapphire, which is my preferred gin. Then we're going to be using one part blue Curacao. Time to restock, I think. But this will give it the nice blue colour. One part lime juice. It should be quite good. And then once it's all combined in the um, in the shaker, we give it a good shake to combine it all and put it in the martini glass and hopefully it's going to look amazing and blue and delicious so we get half a part for this or one part let's go one part that's up never it's quite a syrupy thing this i'm sure it's going to taste absolutely delicious i'm really looking forward to it it's not a keto drink but i might have to take the sacrifice just out of curiosity Plonk that ice back in there because the ice, uh, the glass is all nice and chilled. We give this a good shake. So what you gotta do is give that a good shake until you pretty much can't hold it anymore because it's so cold. It's gone really cold because of high volume of alcohol in this cocktail. And look at that color on that. It's a fantastic drink. This is all made in real time. A blue arrow cocktail. So the final thing left to do is the taste test. I'm just going to give it a chug. Mm. You can taste the orange from the curacao. You can taste the lime and a little bit of cherry, but the gin's a big hitter. It's a really strong cocktail, but I'm sure you agree. It's got a beautiful colour to it. Look at that, isn't it pretty? So if you like what I do, please hit the subscribe button. See all the links for... Um, the people in the links below there'll be eye cards floating around please hit them check out the other collaborators this is ryan g from ryan g's barbecue and stuff see you again soon cheers guys mm.